two favorite Judys on the face of the earth. Judge Judy and this girl right here. She's here today with some delicious Korean recipes. Please say hello to my celebrity chef friend, Judy Ju. Hey. Yeah. You too. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. So, for me. what are we making today? We are going to celebrate Lunar New Year coming up in mid-February. Okay. The new moon, and she deserves our praise. She's worthy of our praise, and we're going to do that with symbolic and traditional dishes from Korea. Mm. Little Korea styling. That's going to start out with rice cake and dumpling soup, vegetarian broth, yummy, yummy, and then a seafood pancake with a fragrant soy dipping sauce. This looks so good. So good, and of course, you have to toast in the new year with a little bit of a drinky, drinky to celebrate. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. And what's this? For this, we're going to make the dumplings first. A little bit labor intensive, okay. but it's okay. These are vegetarian. It's okay. Yeah, so we've got a lot of vegetables that way we love. You know, mushrooms, carrots, spring onions, cabbage, etc. We're going to mix them some I eat seafood. Oh, amazing. Yes, yes. Great. Something had to give. Yeah, there you go. There, yes. I mean, you got to get some. It's, it's hard to get enough protein in your diet. Yeah. This is protein. Uh huh. Good. Tofu. Tofu. So a lot of great things can go in in here. We got some soy sauce, some sesame seeds, sesame oil, a little bit of sugar. You can leave it out if you don't want it, but I think it helps balance. It brings out the sweetness in the vegetables. Then we're going to mix it all together. Mix, Judy mix, has mix. Uh, three yep. restaurants, two in London and one in Hong Kong. Yep. You got to come visit me. How? How when are you going to come visit me? So who's running the restaurants while you're not here? I've got good people. You got to get people for this. You know, you, you got to micromanage a little bit, but now, how do you know? Make the dumplings. Okay, do you want do you want his part no, cake? Uh, no? No. No. So you take a little wrapper, put in a little scoop of the filling, mm -hmm. just, just a little bit. Then take your magic finger, dip it in the water, make a little rim. Okay. And it's like a parcel. And this is why this soup is also symbolic. <laughs> it's this ingredient, because it's a purse, which oh. represents wealth and money. Okay. And these rice cakes look like coins. You can't eat them like this. You gotta cook them first. Okay. But also because they're white, prosperity, start the new year right. And I do like the fact that we're making this vegetarian today because, you know, new year, cleanse body and soul. Yeah. You know, kind of like what, what, what they Nobody needs saying. all that meat. Exactly, exactly. And we're gonna put the dumplings in too. Do you, you speak Korean? A little bit. A little bit. I'm not fantastic. Of course I have an accent because I'm a Jersey girl. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> Down in dirty Jersey, girl. I was just there this weekend. And so have a taste. We made a good, nice seafood broth. There's seaweed in it, shiitake mushrooms, mm -hmm. all this stuff. Some garnish on top. Going to put some scallions, a little bit of egg if you want to, some seaweed that's full of umami, and oh a God. sprinkle of sesame seeds. This is fantastic. Make it, make it beautiful. Good luck, prosperity, health, wealth. Happiness, love, and joy in the new year, all in this bowl. <laughs> Traditional, symbolic, everything I'll that you want. Up. And that comes. <laughs> go home. And so, this, we're gonna serve this alongside our seafood pancakes. Okay, go ahead. this is a traditional thing that we eat also on New Year's. And there's a little bit of luxury here because New Year's celebrate with luxury. So, we've got some scallops and some shrimp, some veggies. We're gonna put that into a batter. That's got you know, some... black people always dance when we eat. Yeah? Korean people do too. All right. Right? <laughs> We're going to dance when we when cook. When it's good, With we get down. Sticks. That's good. Right? We're going to mix in some denjon, mm. that's fermented, <laughs> fermented soybean paste. Get some good mm. flavor in there. Mix it together. Mm. You like chilies, right? Mm -hmm. You like hot stuff. So we got some chilies in there too. Seafood pancakes. I don't mean to brag about my friend here, <laughs> but that is tasty. She's going to be cooking in the Olympic Village. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Support our athletes. Wow. Maybe um, right. some, some nice men out there too, you know, those hard, hot bodies. <laughs> Olympic Village action. Wait, <laughs> so, are you single? I forget. Yes, you asked me about this last time. It's okay. But I... maybe not for long. <laughs> well, what do you like in a man? Oh, I want it all. <laughs> Don't we all? I want it all. <laughs> Smart. Awesome, capable, successful, kind, loving, generous in every way. Yes. Spiritual, mm. you know? That sauce, that sauce is everything. It's everything. Oh. It's got spice, it's got sweetness, it's got saltiness, it's got earthiness. So you dip the pancake in there, just cook this until it's nice and crispy. A mm. little bit of a drink on the side. This is called our Psy Sour, named after the K-pop star, you know Gangnam Style? No. Whoop, whoop, oh. yeah. Really? yeah, Gangnam Style. Look here. Cheers. To Jersey. To Jersey. And to the Korean Olympics. And cooking for the Lunar New Year. And to you, Judy Ju. Thank you for Thank being you. here. Thank you. For more information on these
Judy's Recipes and Judy's book. Go to wendyshow.com. Ask Wendy is next. Hey!